Prepare the controls before preparing the thrombotest reagent. When controlling capillary samples, 900 microliters of distilled water should be used. Gently tap the vial to remove any lyophilized material that may be adhering to the rubber bung, then remove the cap and the rubber bung. Add 900 microliters of distilled water to the vial. Then replace the rubber bung and the cap and mix gently. Allow to stand for 15 minutes. The target value can be found on the control assay sheet. Use the Thrombotest 50 microliter WHO value. Thrombotest is reconstituted with calcium chloride. You'll see here that 12 ml of calcium chloride is provided, but only 11 ml is actually needed. Again, tap the vial, the thrombotest vial, to make sure that there is no lyophilized material adhering to the rubber bung. Then remove the cap and the rubber bung. Also remove the cap and the rubber bung from the calcium chloride vial. Calcium chloride needs to be added to the thrombotest in no more than three additions. Here a 5000 microliter pipette is being used, so the reagent is being added in three additions. Two of 4000 microliters and one of 3000 microliters. This obviously requires the pipette volume to be adjusted as shown here. Add the final aliquot of calcium chloride, then replace the rubber bung and the cap and shake vigorously. Then leave to stand and check that all reagent has dissolved and there are no lumps before using.